rolling. Sure. We're going to get down with it. the Captain's Crunch. This is a uh, high gain steamboat amp. We don't make a lot of high gain amps, but this is uh, this is a 80s style all tube high gain amp. Uh, it has a cool feature. It uh, has two sets of power tubes in the power amp. So this purple knob controls the volume of a pair of 6L6s and the pink knob controls a volume on a pair of EL34s. So you get some cool power tube mix in the action as well as a bunch of variables with the tone stack in game. So yeah, the Captain's Crunch. It's tight. How many watts? 100 watt amp. Okay, cool. Hey, Jake. Cool. <laughs> so, work. so that. <laughs> Where is, uh... So that was Jake uh, from Steamboat. Uh, he made this for me. It's an amazing amplifier. Um, I picked out this Tolex. He um, he he um, he got this custom for me. I think it was like out of they were out of stock or something. Somebody found it. It's amazing. I love this amp. Um, I use it live. I don't play through um, uh, these cabinets. I play through Emperor cabinets from Chicago. But in the studio, I use the Steamboat cabinets. They sound great. They've got uh, hem hemcom speakers, that are especially made for Steamboat. Um, so at Nothing America shows, you won't see this cabinet, but you'll definitely see this. And uh, we usually um, run another signal directly into the board. Is that right, Cade? Yes. Using this tube DI box which is pretty cool. Um, I think this is a, what, SM57? 50, yeah, SM57 and a uh, 421. And a 421, until we mic it, it's pretty Very standard. standard. Um, for tonight's session, I'm gonna be playing uh, two guitars. Uh, this one guitar, uh, it's kind of a hot-rotted, uh, it's an original 1985 uh, RG550, I mean, as, see, it's been through some, it's been through some battles. Um, it's a pretty bad, badass guitar, I had Cade put in um, the Steve I Evolution pickup in the uh, in the neck position, in the bridge position. This is also a Steve I uh, Evolution pickup. It's turning a little sad. Yeah, of course we got um, you know Floyd Rose. I don't use the bar. I uh, use my palm uh, to get the whammy action going on. But this is an awesome guitar. Uh, it's an original '85 Japanese, so it's not one of the new fake ones. It's pretty badass. Um, the other guitar I have for today's session. This amazing guitar that was custom made for me um, by Perry Riggs of uh, Slash L Guitars. Oh, there we go. That's Can you get it in there? Yeah, that's a good. That's so a um, good. this guitar is um, was custom made for me. Um, he pretty much just went wild with it. It's got an EverTune uh, bridge, so it never goes out of tune. It's got gears in it that keeps the string tension the same. So when you play it, uh, it never goes out of tune. You could drop it on the headstock; it wouldn't go out of tune. Uh, it's got EMGs. These things can go from super loud to just dead stop quiet. Um, neck through, it's got a magnetic battery case to power the uh, EMGs. Uh, it's got built-in wireless here. Um, it's pretty amazing guitar, plays like a dream. He even put my wife's name on the headstock there. So that's pretty cool. Um, this is a shot of the front of the headstock. All around amazing, amazing instrument. So I highly recommend you check them out. Uh, Perry Riggs slash L Guitars out of uh, Richmond, Texas. Super badass. Let's go over to the pedal board. Again, not a super complicated, uh, not a super complicated uh, setup here. I run uh, uh, Steve I Gemini Distortion. This is like super, super fuzzed out. This is a little more mellow. I run a Big Muff, uh, Super Muff. All the time this runs, kind of a ode to uh, Mud Honey. Um, of course, the Polytune, uh, tune all your strings at one time. Uh, this is an amazing um, uh, uh, wah pedal. My wife got me this. The Dunlop wah. It's got a lot of switchable uh, parameters, built-in effects. It's just super dope. Um, this is a DB pedal uh, from the people at Way Huge. It's super cool. Um, you know, for your loud, soft, loud, soft stuff, it works great. I understand it's not working right now. I guess it doesn't power the rest, it, the board uh, doesn't work if this is not turned on, so we have to fix this. Um, my wife also got me this Sparkle Drive uh, Vuda Lab pedal. Gives a nice little sizzle um, for rhythm playing, very cool. 
Um, there's, and you see there's some empty space here. We're going to add some more pedals to the board, but right now this is all that we're using. And uh, that's about it. I'm Jeff Schmitz, uh, Nothing of Merit. Check us out at Bandcamp or uh, our vinyls available on our Bandcamp site. Cheers. Thanks.